Good evening and thank you for choosing KTAP News. I'm Joni McKinnon. And I'm Bob Bartlett. For two days, we've been reporting on the 10th annual Guns and Hoses Rodney Holder Memorial Blood Drive. A competition of sorts between the Abilene Police Department, and, which Rodney served, and the Abilene Fire Department. So when the totals were revealed, it was a new record high. The police department, the guns, receiving slightly more pledges than the hoses, just edging out the fire department by three donations, 178 to 175, 353 this year's total. KTAB News Director Travis Ruiz was there at the Hendrick Regional Blood Center for the trophy presentation. All right, guys, the results are in. We're here with both chiefs and folks from the Hendrick Regional Blood Center and Tyler Holder. First, let's talk about all those blood donations. What does it mean to get that many donations, Kelsey? It's so important and it's so incredible. We've been in such a shortage for such a long time now coming out of COVID. So having all of these donors come out and donate, what it means to us and all the patients receiving the blood is so important and so wonderful. Amazing, and a first time blood donor, Tyler Holder, what does it mean to, for you to see so many people donating in memory of your father? It's amazing. Every year we put this on, I'm blown away by the response and the fact that we hit our 300 donor goal and then some, that's incredible. So thank you, Abilene. We are so excited and for the first time we've got a trophy. So we're gonna let Tyler do all of this and so the results are in so i'm going to move out of the way and we're going to get this trophy so we've got both chiefs here ready so kyler the results are in it was a very close race but in the end the winner was guns all right guns all right so chief dudley is here with us and so of course this is his first guns and hoses chief dudley what's your reaction hey this is absolutely amazing from my first time having this experience i'm telling you it's incredible the support that we had this year i look forward to many more years of this to come great work and chief flores i guess you didn't win <laughs> what's your reaction to that well i can't be disappointed uh, obviously shattering that record of 300 and uh we're all winners. Abilene has come through, like Kyler said, and uh, this is just a great day. It really is. All right, so in the end, I think Abilene gets that trophy all together. But congratulations to the guns. Back to you guys. All right, thank you, Travis. What a great success. Mm -hmm. Again, thank you to all of you who made today and yesterday the two-day combined so successful. They were both experienced and first-time donors.